Okay, so morning routine today is starting on a Tuesday this week. Um, I woke up on Monday yesterday just feeling a little under the weather. It took some time to recoup, get better, feeling a lot better this morning. So we're back with another Monday morning routine. So here's what I have going on. It's getting very, very, very close to September, which means I'm going to be posting this a little later on Instagram, but I did get my September budget complete. I also printed out the cash envelopes. I showed on my last um, money morning routine video how to make these. So I made the rest of them. I'm just using my garden theme envelopes this time and I'm going back to using the six cash envelopes cashless for my gas purchase, which means I'm just using the spending tracker in my wallet. So that's done. The next thing I got done um, this morning was I got updated on my spending. Um, you can see here, this is my checking account spending. This is my cash um, expense tracker. So I just had some, that big purchase for the car insurance came out. We pay our car insurance. This is for me and Christopher's car every six months. Um, so that came out, but I did have quite a bit in my car insurance sinking fund that I already put into my account. It offsets some of that cost. The rest, my checking account cushion just ate. Over here on my cash expense tracker, we did have um, some, not a lot, but some cash spending um, yokes for $30 there. I also got my recipes uh, because I wasn't feeling well. I usually like to do my meal planning either on the weekend or on Monday. Since I wasn't feeling well, I just saved it for today. But I did, while I was laying in bed, get some recipes picked out uh, to eat this, to make this week. So we're gonna do uh, tomato zucchini pasta, Mexican street corn soup, a tortellini uh, with sausage, just a one pan recipe. And then we're going to be making Italian meatball soup. So a lot of soups, it's getting a little colder here, even though it's like today's only supposed to be in the sixties, but this weekend's supposed to be in the nineties. It's really weird. So I got that done as well. So if you go back, I just need to do one more thing. If we go back to my budget here, remember, I am every single time I'm going to look and see if I can fill in my actual call. And life insurance did come out for 810, so I can write that. So now the only one, and a car insurance for 108750, that came out. So the only one now we're waiting on is YouTube TV. So that tells me, and that's for $83. So we come back to my checking account expense tracker. If you look at my balance of my checking account, you can see it's 1342. If we minus and subtract the YouTube TV, I'm left with about, let's just say 1250. This tells me that's the amount that I have as my checking account balance. A lot of people ask me how I track my checking account cushion. Well, my cushion is the 1250 because nothing else is coming out. All of my bills are done. Everything is done and paid for. So I know I have no other spending besides what I have going on for any variable spending coming out of my checking account with only a couple days left. I'm pretty comfortable in saying it's around 1250. Now, usually I like to keep about $1,000 in there at any time. Sometimes I go um, a little bit less, a little bit more depending on my month and what I have going on. So with that all being said, my September budget done, my cash and checking account spending updated, my budget updated, my cash envelopes made, I am ready. Oh, one more thing. I'm ready for September. One more thing. Here's another thing I did. As we get closer to closing out my budget now, I'm going to be closing out my budget um, this week, at the end of this week. Prep what you can when it comes to your where do my money go worksheets. So in for August, I got my monthly budget category breakdown already prepped. I just have to fill it in. And same with my monthly spending comparison. I already knew my July spending, so I prepped it. It's ready to go, makes it a lot easier. You can see I literally did not fill out a single day on my August meal plan. So bad. Does it mean that we haven't meal plan? No, I just haven't added it to my meal plan calendar. Um, so that's okay. Fresh start in September. Book, hit the refresh button starting in September. Okay, so that is my money morning.